we should define a little bit what we mean by open because uh, there's open as in uh, it's open source, anybody can take it and reuse it in whatever way they want. And I'm not sure that that's always necessary. You know, there's a pragmatic open and there's a ideological open. And the pragmatic open is uh, it's uh, available, it's available in a timely way, in a non-preferential way, so that some people don't get you know, better access than others. And, um, and if you look at our, our, so many of our you know, apps now on the web, because they are uh, you know, ad-supported and free, we, we get a lot of the benefits of open. You know, we, we get, uh, you know, when, when the cost is low enough, it, it does, in fact, create many of the same conditions as, uh, as, as a commons. Uh, that being said, that requires great restraint, as I said earlier, on the part of companies because it becomes easy for them to say, well, actually, we, we just need to take a little bit more of the value for ourselves. And, oh, oh, we just need a bit more of that. And before long, it, you know, it's, it really isn't open at all.